Well, we made it to Christmas Mountain Village in Wisconsin, just outside Wisconsin Dells. This place is kind of unbelievable. It is a coast to coast, so we are going to be doing a full review of this place. And it's probably going to be a fairly long video, I'm guessing, because there is so much to see and do here. Even just in the campground, let alone just down the road to the Dells. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's get back to it right after this. All right, so the campsite is actually really nice. There's a fair amount of distance from the person next to us. We got these great trees behind us. We are on an asphalt slab, which is really nice. We're pretty level right off the bat. Not just a fire pit, but also a barbecue that we do carry our own with us. It's old style picnic table. We'll go take a look at all the amenities, uh, but we've got a lot of amenities right close by. Plus this is a huge resort. So we're gonna take a drive around and check out all the other stuff as well. So uh, no TV channels. There is Wi-Fi, though I'm not hooked up to it because we've got great cell service and I'm able to use my hotspot. So I'll just be working off of that right now, but I might pull up their Wi-Fi just to see how fast it is. I'm excited. I wish I was here for more than five days, but it's gonna be a fast, but fun and exciting five days. What do you think about this place? Oh my God. It's absolutely amazing. Well, you got I to think, see the concierge. I didn't. I can't wait till you see it. I think that um, in five years, this has got to be the best place. Yep, 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 yep. We're going to head out, take a look around right now. Just a few steps from our spot, we have the golf course. <laughs> so we can stand here and say rude things to the golfers. No, maybe it not. Looks like there's even <laughs> so the pool and clubhouse. Very short distance to walk over to this. Well, it's a hill, but it's not bad. Nice size pool. I won't show it because there's a lot of people in it. Pool area, keep gate closed. Yeah, nice. Wow. Seriously, these are the grounds. That's the golf course out there. Okay, I'm guessing if there's a laundry in here, this is it. And I'm right. All right, we've got oh, a whole bunch of washers, a whole bunch of dryers. $2 to dry, $2 to wash. Oh, ice machine as well. And a jacuzzi. I think that's a cooling pool down there, but it's only about a foot deep. Got a nice big pool area here. And this is just one pool area and one, so there's a huge indoor pool. And there's, if you play golf, this is a great place to be. So down the hill and just up, you can see the white truck up there, that's us. So we're really close to that. Now there's another area somewhere over here on the left. There's a baseball field, there's a boat dock. So I'm thinking it's down over there further. So this is the concierge and check-in center. facilities on site. One of them is a pro shop and store and then you got Mulligan's Bar and Grill. Now Mulligan's Bar and Grill has a 3.5 rating. It's basic food. It's, it's, it's good. It's not great according to the reviews. We decided not to eat at anything less than a four while we were here. So unfortunately Mulligan's was out but uh, there's also a ski resort. So apparently this is both a summer and winter 
uh, of all four season resort type place and they have a ski lift behind this and it looks like a number of runs that come down and they have the machines to make snow you can't see it from here so you got a ski lift up there there's a run here there's a couple of runs here through the trees man a lot of them yeah you got one two three four and then the main one coming down from where the lift is we don't see that because it's on the other side and that's where the snow making machines were we'll, we'll take a look at that in a second so there are a number of places to ski down on this mountain and looking at pictures they also have an inner tube and toboggan run somewhere around here too let's take a look inside they do sell firewood and the ice machine we saw in that other pavilion You'd buy the bags here and um, fill them up at that other place. So oh, that's the golf course. I thought that was ski runs. That's a golf course. Oh, drone use. A lot of words probably going to tell you you just don't use them. Prohibits. There it is. Shouldn't they have started with that instead of having like how many words before they get to cannot use drones? So it basically is a golf pro shop. They might convert things over to skiing in the winter, but yeah, there's their snow blowing machines, high speed chair lift, ski patrol. There's the map of the ski resort. Looks like 10 runs or so, a rope tow, and chair lift. Very cool. A lot of diamond runs, and you have a few beginner runs, and the bunny hill. So that's the bunny hill right here. You got the rope tow up. All right, so the uh, the mulligan, I keep wanting to say McMullins, mulligan side of the building. They close up this office here at five. We are quite late in the afternoon. We're around six o'clock or so right now. But they do have boat rentals out here. Let's take a look at that real quick. Oh, here we go. Fishing, catch and release only. The fact that this is a private pond, you probably don't need a fishing license. If I see somebody with a fishing pole, I'll ask. Do not walk on ice. I'll be sure not to walk on any ice if I see any. There are some boats over there. I'm guessing they put the boats away. That's kind of cool. So you can't go over there to the golf course and fish from there. Catch and release. So what is out there? There's a few people fishing over there. Oh, I got a couple of paddle boats. I cannot get over just how nice these grounds are kept up around here. Beautiful area. I'm not seeing any fish from here, but it doesn't mean they're not out there. I'm sure there's plenty. Yeah, ground's kept up extremely nice. They've got a huge um, frisbee golf course out here. Sand volleyball, there's a baseball field out somewhere around here. And we're gonna go take a look at the mini golf right now. These pavilions everywhere for picnics and such, pretty much just come out and use it. Just a couple of the holes right now. This is hole number one, par three. And the grounds around here are nice as well. They've really done a nice job of, of keeping things clean, well-maintained. They've got the golf clubs and the balls just sitting out for you to use. Fun shapes. Two holes, price of one. I guess during the day they have water running through there. That's pretty cool. All right, I am impressed. And now, the other place that we liked really well was the one in Missouri. 
it was an amazing, amazing campground there as well. The difference is we're five minutes away from town here. We had to drive at least 30 minutes or more to get any place in Missouri. So this is pretty cool. Well, that's basically it for the Christmas Mountain RV Resort. A lot of people have cleared out. We had a big group over here. They're all gone. The people next to us on both sides, they're all gone. And we're leaving in just a little bit today. So just a few last minute things. So yeah, awesome resort. Very close to all the uh, town amenities. And it, there's a lot of amenities here, as you've seen. It's, it's just, uh, just a fun place. I definitely want to come back to the Dells. Back when we uh, have a little bit more time and uh, get a chance to play around some more. So anyways, uh, final update, Wi-Fi. They do have in-park Wi-Fi, though we used our own. We have very good cell service up here. And um, like I said, you've got so many different things going on in the park uh, all the time. It's great for kids, but if you don't have kids, they still have uh, pool time for adults only. So this is actually a very, very cool place. They think of everybody. So uh, that's going to be it. We'll go ahead and jump on to our closer right now. So that's going to be it for the campground review mm -hmm. of the Blue Green Christmas Mountain Resort in the Wisconsin Dells. Yep. It's and been a, there's so much to see here. Oh, so there's much so to much do. in. Yeah. And uh, you're going to see a different video of the Dells. Mm -hmm. I don't know which comes first. <laughs> but uh, they do also have a plan that if you want to buy into their resort, mm -hmm. they do have that as well. Uh, we're not opting for it at this point in time. But to be perfectly honest, it's one of the better deals I've seen. It is. So, it is. So uh, yeah. get... Uh, and there's also... Um, you're also going to get an option of some sort of a uh, gift for watching. So... Uh, you might want if you come here check that out. It doesn't. Yeah, uh, they're they're not pushy. They they didn't no, try to. They're to, not uh, hard sell. They're not hard sell, and you get the gift up front. It's a Wisconsin. It's a Wisconsin law. law that they have to give you whatever gift um, for seeing the resort. Yeah, you just up have front. to. You just yeah. have to basically agree to sit through a two-hour presentation. Right. Uh, but they weren't. There's was no pressure to it, yeah. and it's really a nice program they got going here. So check it that is. out as well. But once again, extremely well kept up. Beautiful grounds. Beautiful grounds. Great yeah. people. Everyone here is so nice. And Wisconsin Dells is not just the water parks. No. It's, yeah. There is so much There's more. There's so here. much there. So anyways. Great food. Uh. Hit that subscription button. And hit that bell, let you know when we post every Sunday at 2. A thumbs up for good measure. And Don's not going to commit to this one. But uh, <laughs> anyways, safe travels, and we will see you on the road. Salancha.